Hello, Graham Levette Brown here, and I'm doing a quick introduction to this news story I came across that I thought was really interesting. We tend to think of people like Donald Trump, Steven Spielberg, and Oprah Winfrey as being among the richest people in North America. And here is a woman from China who is richer than all three of them. A self-made billionaire, Jiang Xin, now 47, began her working life at 14 as a factory laborer. Quite an inspiration to the entrepreneurs among us. Listen to what she has to say. Travel to Beijing or Shanghai these days and Zhang Xin's work is all around you. Because this one is the tallest building we've ever built. Nobody really came up with three man-made mountains, right? So that's, that's what we saw. That we said, oh, this is amazing. Her ambition and creative vision is the force behind Soho, China, one of the country's most prominent property developers. Known for its large, architecturally daring projects, 16 in Beijing, 12 in Shanghai, and one in Hainan. Zhang founded Soho with her husband Pan Shiyi in 1995, a far cry from her first job on a factory floor. I think everybody comes from nowhere. That's, that's the thing about China, right? Everybody comes from, nobody comes with money. You know, my, our generation, right? we, were, we were lucky to, to, be a, to be alive. What is it about China and the women of your generation that allows them to achieve that highest level? I think women of our generation went through cultural evolution, right? went through the hardship, went through it coming from nowhere, and suddenly see you know, China's been given so amazing opportunity. So women just seize the opportunity, or, or people just seize the opportunity. And, and in this regard, I think women in China are giving more opportunities than outside. And that's why you see more self-made billionaires, women billionaires than elsewhere, I think, right, in the world. Zhang brought to the table experience in banking and a love of design. Her husband had ambition and business savvy. Together, they built Soho China into a company worth more than $3 billion. To rise to the top, Zhang says women must be fearless and go for their dreams, even if it means resisting social norms. Hardly any man, no matter how well to do, you wouldn't think that, oh, I stay at home. But a lot of women, despite being very smart, very well educated, still at some point decide, oh, it's more comfortable to stay at home. Those are the b real barriers stopping women to go far. When you go into a room for negotiations, mm -hmm. I imagine you're walking into a room of mostly men <coughs> and probably men who are mostly older than you. Mm -hmm. As a woman, as the CEO of Soho, mm. how do you approach that situation when you walk in the door? I don't think about, you know, those are the moments I don't think about myself as a woman. You know, I'm just coming in to do a deal. I need to get it done. What I do is take trending news stories like this and use them to introduce people like you to a way they can begin their flight to wealth using two powerful and harmonious business systems that can be used individually or in combination. One is free to join with no hidden fees. The other is a world-class blogging platform that will cost you $25 per month, but already has a dominant online ranking and global attention that can put your business on steroids. Wherever you are in life, these tools will help put independence in your lap. Click the links below to learn more. Thanks very much for listening.